This is Yoshi on the Teddy Buggy, and I'm not using it in this video. Instead, I'm going to use five different combos that are just as good, but nowhere near as popular. Let's call these the almost meta combos. The first almost meta combo I'm featuring is Yoshi on the Cat Cruiser roller wheels. And believe it or not, it actually has slightly better invincibility than Yoshi Teddy and the same stats. So it's technically, you could consider this, at least Mario Kart experts would consider this the best statistical combo you can use in the game. Yet it's not meta because not that many people use it. What variety of reasons for that? Mostly it's just people prefer that teddy bear. They just like the way it drives. It's more of a feel kind of thing, sight line kind of thing. It's really intangible stuff that you can't really pr really prove with statistics. But I like it. I honestly can't notice the difference really at all. I think that it runs absolutely great. It runs really, really well. And I don't know why I forgot to have my mushroom bad there. But all right, we're fine. We're P5. Pretty good. I honestly don't like this track. I, for a lot of you know, I'm a big Mario Kart 7 player. Like, that's where I came from in terms of Mario Kart competitiveness, I guess you'd say. And I despise this track in this, that game, and I despise this track in this game, too. It's just, just not a lot to it. But, yeah, overall, we're doing good. We started in the back. We're up to P4. It's a hard track to pass for sure. And let's see if we can move up the board even more. Ah, oh, we're going to have to burn that. It's unfortunate. Let's keep that there. Still P4, we're doing okay. I'm gonna hold this and just cruise. A P4 would actually be really good. Really, really good. What is that a Yoshi? Te yeah, we got Yoshi Teddies up there. See, look at that. We're versing the meta. We're hanging in just fine. Actually, I think we're closing in a little bit. A little cat cruiserness. We're definitely not getting outsped in any way. Only thing I'm worried about is getting hit by items. Got this half pipe work. Why not? And let's take this. Oh. All right, we're just going to have to make do. Oh, I did not mean to drift there. Whoops. That was actually an Alex there. We're okay. We're okay. We're going to lose them, though. Nice chill race. We're just going to keep going this way. I feel like it's safer. I'm scared of all the stars. Why did I throw that back? Get out of the way. Get out of the way. All right, we're fine. P4 would be awesome. Oh, boy. Oh, we might get... Yeah, P4, I think, is what we're getting. Maybe not. P5. Still pretty good. I made a mistake there at the end, but as you can tell, keeps up with Yoshi Teddy just fine, actually. Combo number two, we're getting a bit more out there in terms of uniqueness. Diddy Kong on the Koopa Clown with rollers. It has more handling than the meta, but a little less mini turbo and acceleration. And for those that haven't drive, driven the Koopa Clown before, it is a, it's a different beast. But who knows? This might be the combo for you. And I want to get a lot... Someone like Diddy Kong in here because he's super awesome and he can be pretty competitive. I don't know anyone that would actually run this. So it's definitely, I, it might be more of an anti-meta combo, but it's statistically, it's pretty dang close. And you could do some pretty effective things with it as we're doing right now. We'll be able to keep it up. That's to be determined. I'm going to light up that bird. I'm scared of those shells. Let's get rid of all those shells. Beautiful. Beautiful. And yeah, that's a metal combo right there. Birdo on the teddy buggy and up to P2. Got a sound horn. Like, like how this is going. The only thing you just got to be cognizant of driving this is, and I really am trying to be right now, is just the Koopa Clown just drifts differently. I can't explain it. Try it out and let me know what you all think in the comments if you ever try the Koopa Clown. It's just a different thing. Nothing drives like the Koopa Clown, but it can be pretty good. It really can. And it's circular. And we're in first place somehow. Beautiful. Beautiful. We get away with this. I might have to start maining uh, Diddy Kong here on the Koopa Clown. Let's go. Furt P1. Got protection. I'm not giving it up. Oh, they ran into it. That's good for us. I'm gonna pop this here. Come on, I really want to win. Really want to get a win today. That'll be awesome. Ooh, we got a nice lead. No double shells, but we got it. Oh yeah, get our main turbo there. Beautiful. Just like that, we got a dub. Got some meta combo there. Diddy Kong Koopa Cloud. Try it out sometime. If you're set on using the Teddy Buggy, why not just throw Inkling Boy on him? It has a tad more weight than the meta. Slightly less traction. That's about it. We're gonna bag just a little bit. Cheese land. We're at bag land here. I'm in no hurry. No hurry at all. Yeah, let's chill with these. Got our triple mush. 
We'll use those in a bit. Let's coin up. Do our thing. I'm from Wisconsin, so I should be able to execute Cheese Land to perfection here. If I could just get my coins, that would be great. But yeah, if you like the Teddy Buggy, watch just like a little bit more weight. You get knocked around a little bit compared to those Yoshi Teddies. Uh, this is not a bad option. It's actually not a terrible option for you. I'm actually not going to do anything. I'm still going to continue to coin up, or at least attempt to coin up. Not even use the darn item. I like these triple mushrooms. Actually, you know what? Let's, uh, let's use one right here. The opportunity presented itself. Perfect. We're up to seven coins. Three more coins to go. We're in great shape. Don't really care if we even get shelled. Here comes a blue. Get out of the way of that. Yep. Okay, so that's going to get that. I'm going to run to that banana. That's unfortunate. We were just about coined up at that time, too. But yeah, I, I have no problems with this. Honestly, I've really never, ever used the Inkling Boy. So this is a good opportunity for me to, to try him out. And that's just unfortunate, Father Boo. That is why I don't like him. Right there, you've ruined all my plans in life. All right, I think it's time to go. Yep. All right, it's time to go. I've been messing around the back too long. Now, I would really like to get one of those bullet bills. That would be incredible. Or star. Oh, that's not good. Waiting for the shock. We got to get going now. There's the shock. And I'm going to try to borrow this mushroom. I did. Huge. This, that shock actually helped us. In the end, that helped us a bunch. Here we go. It's unfortunate. Cheese line. I can't really show like what this cart could do, but it pretty much is like Yoshi Teddy with the Elite Boy on it. That's, that's really the focus here. We should be able to finish it decently. Oh, we don't get hit by anything. Oh, I'm going to get prodded. Oh, that's unfortunate. That's a typical cheese land race. I got P7. Not much I can really do there. I guess maybe I could have front ran, but no one ever does that. Still, if you like Yingling Boy, throw him on the Teddy Buggy. Here's a combination that I think is gaining in popularity. Luigi on the pipe frame. Of course, Roller Wheels. All these are going to focus Roller Wheels. It has a tad more speed than the meta. Slightly less mini turbo, and I did a iron to start video with the pipe frame. I put I put Yoshi on it, but it is incredible. I I love the pipe frame. I think it's super super undervalued, and you put Luigi on it for that little extra speed, you can't see the difference. It is it is awesome. It is awesome, and we need to just kind of chill here and see what happens. I'm a little worried about the last lap. I'll be completely honest with you. No, no, no. Oh, he really messed that up. That Diddy Kong just drove into the tire barrier. Yikes. Let's get aware of that. I didn't get my drifts, but you know what? We didn't get bombed, so that's a win. Another one of those tracks where anything could kind of happen, but as you can tell, it's pretty racing. We got we got a racing combo here. I'm going to enjoy that, hopefully. Hello, hello. John Pork. Wow. Love that name. He's using Diddy on the, on the Teddy. Of course, people love the Teddy Buggy. Bunch of Teddy, bunch of Yoshi's Birdos too. My gosh, the meta is everywhere here. Hello, hello. Man, I'm just scared of these red shells. All right, so one of them's gone. That's nice. Gonna hold on to that. There's just a bomb that flew in front of me. My gosh, there's a lot happening. Why are you stealing from me? Why me? I'm completely open now. I will be lucky to survive this. Maybe I should take this a little wider. I don't know. Doubles are available. Oh, that's actually a really great pull. Oh, P1. Oh, yeah, he stole it. <laughs> oh, let's go. Luigi Pipe Frame, baby. Beat Japan there. Beat Chad Pork. Oh, that was too good. Okay, we're getting a bit farther away from the meta here, but I still really love this. This is Pauline on the street of rollers, of course. It has way more water speed. We're not underwater here, so that's unfortunate. Slightly less acceleration mini turbo. But I'm a big believer that the Streetle is just an underrated vehicle. A hundred percent. Like there should be more Streetles, especially with all the water tracks there are these days. That came with all like the city tracks and all that. I I'm actually surprised the Streetle's not getting more play. It's great. Oh, actually, we see one in front of me right now. Okay, that person gets it. Lucas gets it. But besides me and Lucas here, no one gets the Streetle hype for sure. And we are just in the back right now. And poor Pauline. Pauline gets like no play, by the way. Like, she might be the she might be the least popular new character. Okay, maybe Wiggler is. I don't see a lot of Wigglers. That's more like a meme combination. 
Man, I'm getting hit by everything right now. You know, people just don't want to see our friend Pauline out here, I guess. And I totally didn't get any items because I was, for some reason, wanted that draft. I just need to collect items at this point. Coins. It's fine. Let's just, let's just chill. We can catch up at Berlin. It's a long track, right? We got time. Although, it's, it's going to be really hard to pass. There's not as many shortcuts as you'd want. Give me a Bully B. That's really what I need. That's not what I needed. And I'm running into flower beds. This is bad. This, this, I might have made the wrong decision with this. I might have been too out there with the meta. No, I'm just, it's a skill gap. Skill issue. Let's be honest here. Good news is it's still not the third segment yet. I'm going to want to burn this. Yeah, let's get rid of this ASAP. Pull the mushroom. I want to pop that star immediately just in case the shot comes. Let's go. Come on, stop. Please. Please, please, please. No shocks are coming. We're up to P5. Oh, wow. I really wanted to throw it at that Yoshi. He looks so vulnerable. Uh, how do aggressive do I be? Let's be aggressive. Oh, I hit, I hit the Yoshi anyways. That's savage. I'm a beast. All right. Here we go. Hello, Walu. Walu, get out of here. Is that a Walu Wiggler? My gosh, it is. Oh, I, I messed that up. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. That was a big mess up. Mushrooms? Oh, is it? No! Dang it. I was aggressive. I wanted the shortcut. And we're going to pay the price. I did this combo some hard. Oh, a lot of shame here. A lot of shame. Mario Kart gods did not like what it did. They're like, Alex, you're a little bit too far away. Just a bit far away from the meta. You can't be doing no aggressive stuff like that. Pauline, it was a good effort for sure. So there you have it. Five almost meta combos. Let me know in the comments if you like using something that's really good that hardly anyone uses. Till next time, take care. See you later. And Pauline, we will do better for you next time.